Good evening, everyone. I just wanted to give some background on communion first. In John 6, 53 through 58, it says, Jesus said to them, Verily, truly, I tell you, unless you eat the flesh of the Son of Man and drink his blood, you have no life in you. Whoever eats my flesh and drinks my blood has eternal life, and I will raise them up at the last day. For my flesh is real food, and my body is real drink. Whoever eats my flesh and drinks my blood remains in me, and I in them. Just as the living Father sent me, and I live because of the Father, so the one who feeds on me will live because of me. This is the bread that came down from heaven. Your ancestors ate man and died, but whoever feeds on this bread will live forever. So thank you, Lord. In this world, we are in the world, but not of it. Thank you, Jesus, in John 17. So if everyone had a chance to get their uh, wafer, bread, or juice, Matthew 26, 26 through 28 says, Now as they were eating, Jesus took bread, and after blessing it, he broke it and gave it to the disciples and said, Take, eat, this is my body. So thank you, Lord. This is your body broken and bruised for us so that we will not be broken or bruised. And if something has happened to us where we have been broken, abused, mistreated, thank you for mending us and making it right. In Jesus' name, let's take the body. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Father. Likewise, Jesus took the cup, and when he had given thanks, he gave it to them, saying, Drink of it all, all of you, for this is my blood of the covenant which is poured out for many for their forgiveness of sins. Thank you, Lord. You don't hold a grudge. You said if we would come to you and repent of our sins, you will remember them no more. And I believe we will remember them no more either. So we thank you for your healing, precious blood. Let's take the cup together. It goes on to say, when they had sung a hymn at the end of it, they went out to the Mount of Olives. So I would like to lead us in some worship. That's all right. Always remember Jesus, Jesus, always keep him on your mind. We My
my hands in soul, soul, raise to you. Amen, everyone. Let's continue to give God all the praise, honor, and glory, for he always makes a way. Amen.